Happy Tuesday. Hello Benji, hello Will, hello Pauline. Thank you for watching. Today I want to talk about uh, your heart and what it matters is just in your heart. If you are one of those people walking around always feeling guilty, you want to be perfect and uh, you feel like until you are not perfect nothing good gonna happen in your life and blaming yourself for everything and all the bad thing happens in your life just you know until you don't stop that and start looking to your heart and find out what your heart wants you are not going to change all you have to do you have to just accept the process accept yourself then the process is going to start you know then you can change now if you are just going by the view of other people seeing you from outside and judging you from outside and see you as a failure, you are fat, you are this, you are that, you're never going to go forward. What you need to find out is what's inside your heart and follow your heart because everything is written in your heart, you know? You are like a clay on a pottery wheel and the universe is the, is the pottery, you know, it's trying to shape you so you are not perfect. And also the universe energy or God or your faith or Allah or whatever, whoever you believe, you know, maybe you don't believe anybody, universe energy, you know, is just looking for people who they have a strong heart. It doesn't matter if they are perfect or if they do everything perfect, as long as they try, then that positive energy is going to come to them. They're going to, they're going to see more result than people who they walking around and just feeling guilty all the time, blaming yourself all the time about everything, you know? But you just have to accept this. We are not perfect. We can make mistakes. And you just have to learn to get up and start again. People who they fall down and they don't get up and they don't try because they fall once, then uh, they just follow in their brain. Uh, following your brain is very dangerous because your brain and logic was there to just keep you safe but if you follow your heart then you're going to be happy if you are looking for happiness now look into your heart and see what the heart says to you all the time now the universe is not looking for somebody who look gorgeous or you know who they are not fat or it's just looking for somebody who they have the right heart and they just want to do the right thing you know and they are looking to help other people and look after other people they don't have batting in their heart for other people you know if you have the right heart to do things you're going to be successful but if you are just trying to do things to make money and you know uh, to do for other people and keeping other people happy that means you haven't accepted yourself and until you don't accept yourself you won't be successful the first step is to accept yourself who you are and then try to look into your heart and try to start to know yourself if you start to know yourself, that's when you actually can start making progress. Knowing yourself is the first step. That's what that was my message today to you guys. Kian join me as well. We are on our way with Kian today. We're gonna be driving all the way to London because Kian is gonna go to a seminar, uh, internet marketing. Uh, he's done the course online. Now he has to go and attend the three-day seminar <laughs> yeah, and see what he actually learned. <laughs> Ready to get kicked. Exactly. Three days of 10 hours every day. We're going to go there and he's going to be learning about internet marketing. Obviously, I'm going to be there as well listening, but that's basically for him. I'm trying to teach him uh, to be into the self-development already from this age. Otherwise, it's going to be very difficult when he's older to accept he needs to keep learning. That's why, uh, you know, I take him with myself to the seminars and the stuff I go. So this is going to be a three-day seminar. We're going to go with Kian. Yeah. Yeah? You ready for it? No. Uh, yeah. Half an hour. <laughs> <laughs> Half an hour time, we're going to be driving to London. And tomorrow from 8 o'clock to 5 o'clock for three days, <laughs> he's going to be... No computers? Indulging himself. Actually, with computer. You can bring no. the laptop. Yeah, we can take the laptop. Well, what do you mean? Because he's going to teach you on the laptop and what you have to do. Oh, he's going to tell us to make it online. Yeah, you have to do it online for, in front of him, live. Oh, no. Exactly. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs>
Let me just quickly go See back inside and watch all of them again. <laughs> <laughs> See you guys. Thank you.